Bienvenidos a todos al segundo día de la Conferencia Nacional de Early College. My name is Christine Estenos and I am a student of Early College. I graduated from Wilson County Early College in May of 2012. Currently, I work as a paralegal and a translator here in Raleigh at Hale and Associates. I am not your typical 20-year-old. For many students, the transition between high school, college, and getting a career is difficult. Less than half of students who go to community college finish in six years, and those who do finish and graduate with a degree leave with debt or struggle to find a good job. Things are different for me because of early college. I would like to discuss with you guys why I chose early college and how it shaped the direction of my life. So I come from a middle class family. My parents are both from Cuba. My mom went to college for just two years and my dad did some college, but um, he never got any degree. Uh, my parents both taught us Spanish because they said it would help us, me and my brother, to find jobs. And they emphasized the importance of us of getting a good education in order to get a job. Um, my brother went to middle college and that really sparked my interest of early college because I saw that he was getting college classes and he graduated with almost two years of college credit, so I was like, wow, he's not wasting any time. So I wanted to do the same thing. That's why I chose early college. So I always did very well in school, and I wanted a challenge. Um, when I started early college, I wasn't sure what career path I wanted to take, but I knew that early college would prepare me um, because of the advanced coursework, because of college preparation. And it was a perfect fit for me because I was surrounded by students who all wanted a college education and they cared about schooling just like I did. Um, I had a busy schedule and tough classes, but that helped me to stay focused. Um, being on a college campus was a little bit scary at first, I'll be honest, um, we, but we eased into college classes together. I remember taking my first college classes with other students from early college. So um, we got to, uh, we were immersed into that together and we adapted together. Um, in college courses, we learned and we had to collaborate with students of all ages, which helps to prepare you for the real world because once you're in the workforce, you're collaborating and working with people of different ages. Um, many of the college students were actually impressed by our age and they would say, I wish we had a program like that when I was your age. So that really made me proud to be a student of early college. And I thought, I really need to take advantage of this program. I'm lucky to be in this program. So I knew it was a great opportunity I was having. Um, after about one year at early college, I decided that I wanted to be a paralegal. So I would pursue my associate in paralegal technology. And later on, I would decide whether I was gonna go to a university or not. Um, at 17 years old, I was offered the opportunity to start working at a law firm in Wilson, Ferris and Ferris, and um, my instructor told me about the job. I interviewed for it, I got the job, and I would work 25 hours a week at that law firm. So I started young as a legal assistant and an interpreter, which was really good. I was thankful that they gave me a job at such a young age. Um, being busy helped me to stay focused because I was balancing 25 hours of work. I was balancing high school classes and college classes. Um, and I was able to put into practice immediately everything that I was learning at school, at my job, which was really great. The staff at early college was very um, amazing. They were very involved. They helped me with everything. They helped me choose my major. They told me what my options were. They helped me make a schedule. And most of all, they helped me to stay balanced. Um, they helped me to like make sure that I wasn't taking on too much, but at the same time, they, they, they would always ask to help me, Christine, make sure you're not doing too much, or like they would help me focus on my schedule. Um, I graduated last May in four years with my high school diploma, my college degree, and most of all, preparation to work. Um, right now, I work at a criminal defense law firm here in Raleigh as a paralegal and early college is what made it possible for me to do this. So now at 20 years old, I have three years of experience um, working in my field. I have an associate's degree and I can say that because of early college, I was given the opportunity of a lifetime. I was prepared to enter the workforce and I got a head start on a great career. So I really wanna thank them for that. Um, just like yesterday, you guys will have the chance to meet many early college students like me Will our student ambassadors please stand? 
I don't know if there are any. Okay, over there. I also encourage you to ask them about their experience, ask them their future plans, and ask them how being an early college student has transformed their lives. Um, hopefully, you will leave here today with plans and strategies to create more opportunity for students like me and students like them to call themselves early college students. Now, it's my honor to welcome Joel Vargas to the podium. He leads the work for Jobs of the Future High School through College Team and helps us to set the organization's priorities and direction. He also researches and advises on state policies to promote improved high school and post-secondary success for undes undeserved students. He has helped policymakers and intermediary organizations develop state and federal policies that expand early college schools and other school designs incorporating college coursework into high school. Please welcome Joel Vargas.